that song gets a uh, copyright blocked on my Twitch VODs uh, every time. And usually when that happens, I remove the song from the playlist. But I really like that song. So I haven't got like a, it's not a copyright strike. It's not like a DC, DMCA or anything, but it's like it just mutes the, the audio of the VOD. Oh, well. It's a good song. If you're on YouTube, you have no idea what I'm talking about. Watch me live on Twitch at twitch.tv slash d20crit. All right, that's enough of that. Okay, let's be a cat. Here we go. Here I go to be a cat. Knock that off. Knock it off. Knock it off better. Wow, okay. Got it. Oh. We're still under the dome. Okay, but where's my backpack? That's what I want to know. I can't meow when I had the keys in my mouth. There you go. Why is there a keyhole on the inside? He didn't like do the thing where you reach around and he didn't do the reach around. He just put the keyhole in on the other side. It's okay. All right, where are we going, bud? Or she, I suppose. Her name's Clementine. I don't. I don't know what what pronouns this robot has. It is rather presumptuous of me to assume he. I don't know what you said. key in the hole without so much of the courtesy reach around. I know. That's what I'm saying, Ted. Oh, there's my buddy. this part where it's completely non-verbal like these two cannot understand each other right now stealth mode i can't i can't go any faster than that. there it is why is that so slow oh it's because we had to get clementine down here to get <laughs> to get on cue for the cutscene. Gotta be kidding me. Okay, there we go. That solves part of this equation. Okay, so I can get down and over here. 
Okay, there we go. Whoa! Oh, okay. And we got a box. Box is great. The box being here is not to hide from the beam and when it's in patrol mode, but if it spots you, that's to hide when it's in pursue mode. I understand now. Get up on the thing. Oh, there's an upper platform now too. Oh, okay, okay, got it, okay. I was worried that it would uh, sweep horizontally at the upper level, but no, it actually just elevators right there, and then I can do this. Another box over there. Oh, that was, that was a bold move, Cotton. I was not, I didn't think that one through, but it worked out well, okay. Kill the juice. Yeah, that's right. I turned off your lasers, buddy. I don't know what to do next. Okay, they went back into to looking around, but they're on high alert. Okay. Can I? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I feel very powerful. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. I feel very powerful, he says, as he almost dies immediately. Although it's not like an instant death. I don't actually know what the consequence is, but it doesn't it doesn't feel like it'd be good. They are shooting lasers at me when they uh, are trying to get me. Okay, so those lasers are off now too. I just gotta get... I guess that would have been a shorter way through that door there. Whatever. Oh, shit. Can I get up? Can I get up? Can I get up? Yup! In theory, they can only see what is in their little scanning eye. Yeah, alright. You guys are really bad at your jobs. <laughs> you literally have one job. You're a sentinel. You're, you can't even sent in properly. Hi, buddy. My Clementine's hand says, kiss me. Right in the kisser. I love that. I trapped my lab's computer system again all the way. He came back for me. I can't believe it. You're a good friend. But we're all together again, but we're not safe yet. Open that door. Yeah. All right. Yeah, see? Useful robot. Cool, so now that we have this, there is one memory here, which means the last chapter of the game likely... Oh, there's two memories? One memory. I missed a few. Whatever. The last chapter of the game likely is without B12, if there's no additional extracurricular memories attached to it. What does that one look like? Looks like it's exterior. There's a dead robot against a dumpster. Cool. It's very uplifting. Why, why are we giving Clementine bricks? arming the robot. Take the shot. Nice. We're gonna alley-oop. Yeah, we are. Oh, thank you. I love that. Just leave the time behind. See ya. Blocking the way again. Bait them into the cells and lock them in. That sounds terrible. Thank you for volunteering me for this. I love it. 
Oh. Hello? You see that guy on the ground over there? He was rebooted. I don't lose my memory. I'm so scared. Okay, Pablo. Don't worry. I mean, like, worry a little bit, but... Recovery Center has done me the greatest good. My mind is clear and lucid. I am an exemplary citizen now. Okay. Once again, I hate that. Alright, I see. I see. I can see what's happening. They don't have a clue. We're gonna do this. Huh! Was I the cat? Okay. Now what? Oh yeah, he's gonna open this one up. Hey, there's a memory. Seems the sentinels are ruthless when it comes to defying them. That's what I feared. He's completely erased him. No more emotions, no more self awareness, no more memories. Let's not get caught. Well, kind of bummed that we missed so many memories, but I am fine with it. Hey, don't get me in trouble. I only have 758 years left, then I'm free again. Capone! His name is Capone. All right, so I got I got two. Okay, okay. Oh, oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Get fucked! Got it. Yeah, that's right, guys, come on out. We're done. Can you stop messing with that? Rats. Yeah, jail over, come on. Well, what's your deal? Looping, ah ha ha, what you did, <laughs> that was funny. Thank you. We're, we're leaving them? All right. Never mind, jailbreak over. Go. I know, we're not in the clear yet. Let's go. Or do I have to do things? Oh, is this, is this? Yeah, it is. door. It's the only way out of this jail. I think we can open from the control room over there. Run a way to access the room. Let's look around. Why did I lose my ability to run? That's weird. Yeah, when I get there, I can't run anymore. Is it perhaps this bright yellow part of the part of the game? Ah, there we go. Got to back up the truck, jump from the truck onto the fence.
Red means no, not that way. God. No. Come back. Serpentine, serpentine. Let me jump on, thank you. What? Why did that? What's going on? There we go. This is cool. The audio got kind of desynced because Beltrix jumped on my computer and messed with the plug to the controller. <laughs> What a brat. Can't make it out with all the sentinels on our tail. I can distract them, but you have to go. You must go outside at any cost. I wrote that. You're one of us. Now. It's not that everyone has to go to the outside, but one of us has to. Keeping my ram, little outsider. Cute. the subway. If the end credits don't give us the name and picture of the cat's voice, we'll be very upset. They have, I don't know if it's in the end credits, but I have seen the the name and picture of the actual cat that did the voice, the voice work for the, the cat. Um, I don't remember the name of the cat though, but it is on the internet somewhere, so it might be from the credits. Um, hello? Is this not is this not my my exit? Am I not taking this subway out of town? Is it a different subway I must take? Oh, I need the battery. That's right. They showed us this lock before showing us this key. I forgot about the lock though. That's not their fault, that's my fault. I love that the atomic battery still looks like a like a C battery, it's just kind of big though. Cool. I also like that this digital thing uses a real ignition key still because tradition. Each stage we've seen of the city, like each tier essentially, it's gotten a little bit nicer. 
Hello, how may I help you? Wow. Like it's it's clean. This this is kind of fucked up, but fun. Oh my god. <laughs> Greetings, inhabitant of Walled City ninety nine. I'm currently painting this area. Please be careful of the wet paint. Have a nice day. Jesus. Oh, that's the ceiling right there. Oof. All right. What does it say? City sealed, violating rules of confinement will result in heavy prison sentence. Greetings, inhabitant of Walled City 99. This door leading to the surface is currently locked due to confinement procedure. Please refer to any certified engineer inside the control room. If you have any requests, have a nice day. Hello, how may I help you? Hello, my current task is clean the window. Please refer to any certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. Have a nice day. Control room. Conveniently labeled. Hello, city has been sealed for your safety. Alright, yeah, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it, okay. Still having gendered bathrooms in the far future. Robots don't have genders. I mean, actually, robots could have genders. Robots don't have sexes. We're really gonna get down to it. Control room is closed by some sort of security protocol. It says only humans are authorized to enter. It also says that I'm not considered human. Hey, that's offensive, security protocol. Maybe we work together, we can open this passageway. Wow. What a concept. What happens if I do it again? Oh ho 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 ho. How do I... Wants me to triangle it, but nothing happens. The fuck? Can't re oh, hi, buddy. Come over here. That's not what I meant to do. What happens if I turn it on and stand on it? Can I ride it? I oh, know he just gets very confused about which way to go. All right, all right, all right. Let's go I'm over here. Oh, that's why this is right here. Look at how clever this is. This is like, it's like one of those you see it in, in like carpeted. Um, kind of more industrial environments, like a, like a classroom or something like that, where it's got like the carpet or like an office building, I suppose would be a great example. But like you have to have access panels sometimes for like whatever underneath, like outlets and shit like that. So it's like the, the metal grate, but the carpet's on the, the, the lid too. That's what this is here. But it serves the purpose of telling us that something goes there. I love that. Okay. All right, hit the button again, and I'm, I'm in position now. Whoa, there we go. No, get on top. Smack the wires. Hacker cat. I just got the uh, territory achievement, which I think is for scratching in each of the chapters. Makes sense. Oh, do I need to bring that little guy in? Hey, little guy, come on. No? What, are you, like, just dead now? But you see now that I've seen these things, this might like pop one out. But now I've seen these little spots, I'm looking for it. Maybe not. It's the control room for the entire city. They control everything from here. Empty. I remember hating this so much. They had everything. Clean space, limitless power, freedom to move. A little good it did them. 
The plague. I remember now. Everyone was dying, and they thought they were above it all. They did nothing to help us. I watched my family die. I felt helpless. I couldn't do anything to save them. I can still help you. Still go outside. Together. I will carry the memories of humanity and the people I loved. Oh, a new memory. Hold on, we have important cat business to attend. Knock it off the thing. Very hard to control. Okay. Knocking it down is, is good enough, to be honest. We don't have to knock it all off. Come on, get up there. Thank you. Knocking it off is ideal, but sometimes it's very difficult. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, I want to look at that in a second. I got business. Business. All right, there we go. Wow. Wow. So it actually shows, like, the areas that we went through. Like, there's that, that fucking elevator thing over there. And all the slums down here. Yeah, there's Momo's house right there. There's that city area we were just in. Very cool. Like I could do something. Oh, it's for down there. That's weird. That's it, the main computer. From the mainframe, no one's been here for years. Ooh. Excuse me. Whole city's stuck in a lockdown cycle from long ago. We need to bring the rest of the systems online. Here's all the data we need. We've got to turn them on. Look for the passwords and encrypted keys to get in the system while you do that. Ooh, it's business music. Just fucking yeeted that cap. Oh, I gotta turn them on. I gotta like wake them up. I see. I see. I see. Why? What the hell? Why am I stuck? Um, hello? What the shit? I'm stuck. That's very annoying. We're gonna lose three minutes of progress. Most of which was knocking down cups, I'm sure. So let's just go to the thing and get on, get on with our life. <laughs> Turn on the system. Skip past the thing. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Try it again. Jump through the chair. Good start. That one's already on. Good. Okay. 
There we go. It worked. Good job, my friend. I found it. I know how to open the city. Something's off here. Wait, maybe there's a way around it. Roof control station. System is locked. That's the workstation to open the city. Several layers of security preventing us from using it. Now we need to do what we do best. Me, I'll hack the machines and you destroy some stuff. Oh, buddy, you know me so well. Thank you. Don't mind if I do. I don't know, I don't know exactly how to do that in this case, but we're gonna figure it out. Ah, aha! Oh, yeah. Hacker cat. Don't recommend any actual real life cats doing this if, if any of them are currently tuned in. Not, not safe. No. Is there more? There's gotta be more. Oh, wait, hold on. What's uh, that? Then push a button. All right. Oh, he's gonna hack it after I do it. Of course, he said that. Oh, ow. Oh no, is this gonna kill him on the last one? Uh oh, good thing I already did those other ones. Turns out I am smart. This is gonna kill the robot, and we are gonna be the ones to get the exit and not him. Yeah, he can recharge once we open it up. It's not gonna happen. I think this little body's done for. Okay, all right, just carry me to the workstation. We can disable that alarm. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. come here. This one? There you go. No, not there. How about there? Yeah, there we go. Safe. Call it. Listen, I have something to tell you. I knew the power of the Sable City's central control system would be immense, more than this drone body can handle. Creating that Sable that can take control of the system and open the city. Overriding it could destroy my software. But I made that choice when I hooked into that first computer. The consequences it would bring. Sorry we won't see the outside together. I thought I needed to carry on the memory of humanity to hold on to the past. But I see a future in the companions, and you. Here, let me take that off of you. My pins! They were floating! You're my friend. The very best I could have asked for. Thank you. I actually hate that.
Why don't they like light? Where'd that come from? leave my robot. Mead was really good. It was, uh, I don't know the exact ABV, but it's turned out pretty strong. Oh, it just lets me take a nap next to my, my buddy. That's so sad. I hate it. Okay, we, we gotta leave him behind. I wish I could, like, pick him up and take him with me. Alright. Hold on. Let's say a few words. Okay. I, I don't know where you go next. Do we just wait for it to like open? I don't think there's anything I can do. Fucking now what? <laughs> oh, that's right. There's a big old door here. So, hey, you can't go that way. You have new things to say? No, you're just like catatonic. Yeah, I don't know. Oh wow. That, oh god. The contrast is so good. Because these robots do nothing but clean all day. And then this. It's a very good contrast. Oh, went to letterbox. We're basically done, I think. Yeah, let me get that bird, let me get that bird. He doesn't get back with his friends? Wow. I'm just gonna play the credits. I wonder if I got like all the memories there'd be a, a bonus scene or whatever. I don't know. I wish I got them now, but too late. We're done. Well, that was lovely.
Yeah, I liked it a lot. You don't have any real complaints. Um, I had some notes and criticisms throughout the game that I was pretty vocal about. But I don't think overall it detracted from the experience whatsoever. Um, yeah. I really liked its use of environment to tell the story from the very start where it kind of eases us into the civilization bit by bit by bit and and told the story of what was left of the civilization through the, uh, the scenery and through how these robots were mimicking humans and kind of emulating human life. I thought that was really cool. I think the choice to have um, the platforming to be all con contextual button pressing rather than kind of more free roaming jumping was a good one too because you're playing as a cat and cats don't miss jumps for the most part uh, with the exception of that, that big first one in this game. But other than that, every time you jump to somewhere you know exactly where you're going to and you're going to make the jump. So just pushing a button to jump specifically to a point rather than pushing a jump to pushing a button to jump just in general, I think was a good choice, just game design wise. It made the platforming not awful, because I hate 3D platformers, because usually they do fall into that trap of you can push the jump whenever you want and you gotta figure it out if you're gonna make it. I don't like that. Um, introducing that little like laser beam kind of mechanic with the uh, the bug zapper in the middle of the game and then removing it very quickly felt a little a little jarring but I, I quickly got over it and kind of moved on to the next part of the story because it is very chapter driven each chapter kind of had its own own things to do because then then we were right into stealth mode which was which was really fun to avoid those sentinels um I love that the, the creators of this game clearly just enjoy, or at least understand, cats. There's so many things that you can do in the game where it's like, uh, hey, you know how cats will get up on stuff and knock stuff over? Yeah, we're gonna put that in the game. You know how cats like to scratch up rugs? We're putting that in the game. You know cats like to just sleep, just take a nap and forget about everything? We're putting that in the game. So I like that a lot. They definitely, they definitely knew cats, and, and that love, or at least understanding at the very least, is is apparent in the game right bellatrix she didn't watch most of it bellatrix doesn't even follow me on twitch you don't care do you um having that robot as a kind of an intermediary translator v12 or whatever his name was the companion bot not the companion capital c but the companion to the cat lowercase c um i liked that um, because it kind of helps solidify the fact that this cat doesn't belong here um, and needs to leave. Um, so that, then they can do things like take it away for a moment to kind of shake things up a bit. You're used to having this translator, used to having a way to understand the world better, and then when we take that away from you, it's, it is, it's a contrast and adds in kind of uh, better better definition between the parts of the games because you have the part where you don't have B12 and you have the parts where you do. So I like that. I don't know. I'll probably think of more thoughts on it later too, but I like it. Very good game. Um, I don't remember how much it is on Steam right now. It might be like 30 bucks. I think it, I, I got it for like 20 because they had a free sale before the release. It might be up to 30 now. It's pretty good. If you've got a PlayStation 5, um, I do recommend it on that versus Steam if you have the option. Um, just because that, that extra haptic feedback with the, like the triggers and the controller and the controller making the noises and all that stuff is, is very cool from what I've seen with the uh, the housemates playing it. Um, but I still enjoyed it like immensely here on the PC. Beautiful, gorgeous game. Turn up your graphics settings if you can. Yeah. I think we're going to end it a little early tonight, um, just because we finished the game, and might as well. And yeah, that's good, that's fun. Thank you for watching, and uh, I will be back live, I think, uh, Thursday. 
don't know what I want to play yet. Uh, might just do some more hard space, um, but I kind of want to start another new game. Um, thinking a couple of different things. But yeah, I'll try to figure it out and let everyone know. So thanks for watching. Hope everyone has a great night, and uh, if I don't see you on Thursday, great rest of your week, great weekend. All those things are great. Um, I love you all. Good night.